What is going on guys? It is Monday, the 1st of August, and it's pretty much a bang on 6 a.m. There we go. Uh, welcome to episode seven. So this is, uh, whoa, fuck, I always do this. Um, we've filmed quite a few, you know? This is quite quickly turned in to a series when it started out as a full day of eating that everyone wanted to see. But anyway, today is exciting because we are just under Two weeks out from the WBFF Worlds. We've got Titus who's trying to hide behind that. But uh, we are just under two weeks out from the WBFF Worlds. I am four days from leaving Australia and heading to Vegas. So the closer that gets, the more exciting that is because I feel like absolute death yesterday it was probably one of the hardest days yet. You can even see like my face is drawn in. I'm pretty dry and lean, so. I hit a new all-time low weigh-in for this prep this morning, fantastic. But um, today I've got a cool surprise which should be arriving in the mail and something which is a controversial topic that I'm gonna discuss with you guys because I like to be as transparent as possible and this has given me the opportunity to be quite transparent with yourself. So hopefully it does arrive so I can tell you what that is. But I'm also filming tonight again with Jai and we've got a guest appearance from Josh Andrews. If you don't know who Josh Andrews is, you're about to find out, but this man could quite honestly be um, Australia's best bodybuilder up and coming. He is an absolute fucking freak. Um, I've trained with him before. Uh, you, you just gotta wait and see him. The dude's got hollow bones. I've never seen someone so young, so big and so freaky. Um, but you'll see that the dude's absolutely insane. He's never even done a bodybuilding show before. So if he does compete, he will win. It, it, there's no question about it. Unless he comes in severely overweight and does an eating contest as his carb load, there's no one that could beat him. So guys, it must be my lucky day because this is a cup of miso soup. These are little Japanese croutons. Now, this usually comes with a oversupply of seaweed, which there is none and four croutons. Look at all those croutons. So, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to scoop some of this out because dieting and such, but I mean, if you love bread like I do and your miso soup accidentally comes with like triple the supply of croutons and zero seaweed and you hate seaweed, that must mean it's a damn good day. And I also think my parcel is about to be delivered. So what better timing? False alarm, it wasn't my parcel, but anyway, I'm still having a good day. I've done my cardio. Um, ooh, don't spill miso soup on the fucking lens cap. Um, ah, I've got no hands. Um, we're gonna try. Ooh, there we go. Um, I'm gonna do some editing. I've got a very busy day. Despite not training until 6 p.m., I've got client check-ins and I've got to edit episode four, and I'm filming episode seven, so I'm, I've got a few in the bank. But anyway, we're gonna get stuck into that. I'm gonna do some work, and I'll check in with you guys when I've got something a bit more interesting happening, and hopefully when my big surprise parcel arrives today, because I've been waiting for this, it's uh, been a week. So, you know when I was uh, drinking my miso soup and I said it is my lucky day? Well, I've just heard back, I've been in talks with Renpo, uh, because I personally use the body fat scales uh, purely because it syncs with your phone. I can get my daily weight on there. It plots it and it's incredibly accurate, but uh, they've reached out and there's been a fantastic opportunity which has arisen for not only myself, but also uh, my viewers. Now I'm not gonna be telling you go buy this product. This is um, they're actually giving me some stuff to give to you guys. So anyway, that's, um, that's down the track, but I just thought I'll keep you guys posted. There's a lot of exciting things going on. Um, Renpo is quite a big company in the um, health and fitness and general well-being accessory scene. So to be able to work alongside them and produce some content with them is uh, absolutely phenomenal and it's very reassuring and it's exciting for you guys because um, I'm gonna make sure you guys get more out of this than I do. And from the uh, email um, correspondence, you actually are getting a lot more out of it than I will be. So stay tuned for some updates on that. Mm. 
honestly, for volume, shakes are the best thing ever. 100 grams frozen strawberries, 150 grams uh, almond milk, uh, one scoop of WPI, and some ice. And this makes nearly a liter. But anyway, in the background, we are pumping some old school RuneScape. I have not played this game properly in since I was in school. And that was when it was just RuneScape. It wasn't old school back then. But I finished all my work, well, most of my work, and I figured why not. Um, I'm a noob at the moment. I'm only level 56 and I'm currently trying to grind out some quests. Um, and then on my other screen, I'm fully going deep into this. I'm trying to kill some time. I'm, I'm getting back to my roots and I'm enjoying, my dog is just worming under my couch. Um, I'm enjoying playing some RuneScape. I'm up on the Discord servers, but anyway, um, we're still waiting for that package to come in the mail. So, so it is now 1.40 PM. I'm sitting down to finally eat meal two. Have a little go at this. Now this looks fucking great apart from the presentation, but what this is, it is satay chicken with konjac noodles. And I'm gonna tell you the macros on this sucker because let's have a look. This whole meal here is 370 calories. We've got 61 grams of protein, 22 carb, and uh, that's actually wrong. This does not have 22 carb. This has about 18 carb because part of it is soluble fiber um, and then six fat. So uh, the konjac noodles themselves have one gram of carb. Uh, they 11 calories for all 250 grams of this. But anyway, that's still pretty phenomenal because this weighs just over half a kilo of food. Uh, and it consists of 250, gra 250 grams chicken breast, 250 grams konjac noodles, 100 grams mushrooms, and 20 grams powdered peanut butter, so PB2. So I'm gonna devour this. We're gonna keep playing some RuneScape. We did finish the quest in case you were wondering. And then I'm, while I'm doing that, I'm also uploading a ton of uh, vlog content. So currently getting episode five up and at it while well, this is episode seven. So that's like vlog -ception. I'm gonna destroy this meal. My parcel still hasn't arrived. If you live in Australia, you understand. That's really good. Oz Post sucks. This is meant to be express um, priority mail. They had been provided shipping details on the 25th. So that's seven days ago. And I still don't have it. What can you do? I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to play some RuneScape and I'm going to check back in when my shit arrives. And looks like I spoke too soon. My parcel is just there. Look at this. See, urgent supplies and it still doesn't get here. I wonder if I was dying. Urgent medical supplies. Oh well, I guess we're getting something to talk to you guys about in a second. So after some further deliberation, I decided I can't do uh, these items justice and explaining them uh, with a short amount of time. So I'm sorry to leave you hanging. But anyway, in other good news, it is currently 5 p.m. I'm leaving in 30 minutes to go train with Big Josh Andrews and smash out a big uh, push session, I think today is. So this is one of my last push sessions because it's, is it Monday? Fuck, see, I'm so prep brained out. But anyway, Titus, come here, come here. I am, uh, I've got, I've got the little man here with me. Oh, he's freaking out because he can't touch the ground. But um, oh, I'm gonna miss these guys while I'm gone. But anyway, I'm gonna go get ready to go train um, and then you guys are going to enjoy this epic edit coming up in three, two, and one. Now I'll show you the coyote. Yeah, they send a test. Now they send that a bar like Jerry West. Coming back for what is mine. Can't take no less. I said, go and take your shot. So I need your best. And stop the threat. So nobody's in me. I don't got time. I'm not giving the energy. Too many people around me. I'm finicky. I don't know. Too close, I been up at the top now, so they all wait for the last slide. I seen too many people that switched up.
up, whose man's high? Through it all, I stay the same, I swear to God I can't lie Been down so damn low that I came up for my life They talk way too much on the internet, it's not real life I swear in my fan way and I can't lose and I'm still right Still right, I swear that I'm working them up till like midnight It's real life, I got a time and I'm coming to get my and just like that, I am back home. It is 7.49, the same day, Monday the 1st. I hope you enjoyed that edit. Um, it is gonna be a little dark for a second, but um, Jai, absolute fucking wizard on the camera. And you can see Josh is an absolute monster. The dude is, um, he's fucking big. He's 106 kilos, so he's got 16 kilos on me. And he's in really good nick for um, how heavy he is. But anyway, um, Jesse, somewhere over there, is uh, cooking me dinner. Uh, and would you believe it, I've got to pay her each week <laughs> to cook me one meal. That so. makes me look so, one meal. No, I it's one meal a night. Seven yeah. meals a week. So I pay her, that my wife to be. So bad. I have to pay my wife to be. Keep in mind, she doesn't pay a cent towards the mortgage or rent. I'm telling them, I'm dobbing them in, dobbing you in. She doesn't pay a cent to uh, living expenses. Um, and then still makes me pay her uh, to cook me dinners. You're gonna edit that out. <laughs> That's not getting edited out. The truth is out there. The people deserve to know. But anyway, um, she cooks a mean fucking dinner, so I don't mind. I'm brain dead. It's the same <laughs> meal every night. Whoa, the chicken teriyaki bowl. Tastes much better than it looks. We've got Titus down here keeping us company. Hey, buddy. Um, we're off. Well, I'm off with Jesse, so I guess where to go watch horror movies in bed. This is, I think it's called Incantation. Um, it's on Netflix horror movie. It looks spooky as fucking all hell. Uh, and then we're going to give you a Jesse score afterwards <laughs> and um, <laughs> let you know how it goes. I hope I can muster up the energy to watch it because tomorrow we've got some check-ins, um, my check-in, and it's already eight o'clock. So it'll be a late one. <sighs> But anyway, I'm going to take, just like, hold on, get a look at this. That looks disgusting. No, nah. look at that. Char grilled teriyaki chicken. Uh, the avocado presentation could be a bit better, but that's all right. At least she measured it out perfectly. A little dusting of uh, sesame seeds. <laughs> Busting out all kinds of culinary terms. But uh, yeah, I'm taking this to bed. You know, I eat the same things every day. It's prep. I don't know what you expect, but um, look at the face. Look at the, look at the delt. Uh, we're lean. We're lean. I'm hungry. So incantation looked honestly terrifying and it was one hour and 53 minutes of it. So we opted out of watching that. I don't really feel like being high strung uh, all the way up until 10 p.m and then trying to pass out for six hours before I wake up again. So I opted for something a bit more mellow, uh, keeping up with the Joneses purely because um, in my depleted state, I don't like to pay attention. And I want something easy to watch. Zach Galifianakis is a fucking G when it comes to comedies. He is probably one of the funniest people. So if uh, he can't make this good, uh, no one can. But despite that, uh, meal has been polished. It is, it is gone. It lasted all of four minutes. I've timed myself. Four minutes is how long it takes me to eat that on average. And that is what? 750 grams of food gone, polished off. Um, Jesse's over here doing some wedding planning. Cause if you watched my previous videos, we're getting married in less than three months. <laughs> so, um, Thanks for the added stress. <laughs> so yeah, we're getting all that done. But anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the edit. If you did, please do me a favor and leave a like, uh, comment down below what you'd like to see and make sure you subscribe. I keep harping on about it because it's, oh my God, I'm covered in rice. I'm a fucking mess. Look at that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Um, I forgot what I was saying, sidetracked. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm putting a lot of effort into this. So if you're enjoying it, let me know. But anyway, guys, I will see you in episode eight. Um, oh, geez, I'm dying. I had too much Pepsi too quick. <laughs> episode eight, we are filming with Jordan. <laughs> episode nine, we are filming with Jordan. I'm pumping this shit out. So get used to it. Get excited. That piece of rice fell off me. So I'm going to go find it before my dog does. And I'll check in with you guys tomorrow in the next episode. Can you tell them such uses.